Hello, this is Eric at the Prince George Ford Pre-Owned Super Center, and we're taking a look at the 2016 Ford Expedition Max in a platinum trim and powered by a 3.5 liter V6 EcoBoost engine, providing you with excellent power for some towing, hauling, and 4x4ing with some great fuel efficiency and coming with power deployable running boards down below, as well as having a roof rack up top so you can mount some cargo up there. But let's take a look inside. Third row area and third row seating area, which is absolutely massive, being the Max Edition. And of course, all the seats can be folded flat for a ton of cargo room. Otherwise, you have seating for eight in total with a full leather interior. They get their own cup holders in the third row. And you have this sort of modular cargo system that can be configured with shelves or whatever you need for more storage. And uh, you have power buttons for your rear seats. And this closes again with another simple press of a button. Then looking into the second row, where you have seating for three comfortably with two cup holders in the middle, as well as rear media controls, 12 volt power outlet, 110 volt power outlet, rear climate controls, and heated second row seats. This vehicle has a remote start, so no need to go outside to warm up your vehicle. And looking in, you have power windows, power mirrors, and power locks, as well as two memory buttons for your power adjustable driver's seat, steering wheel, pedals, and mirrors. Now sitting in the vehicle where they're running, you can see it's sitting at 142,638 kilometers. And moving down to the steering wheel, on the right hand side you have your hands-free phone and radio controls, as well as your controls for your right screen, where you have your entertainment, navigation, and phone controls. And moving on to the left, where you have your cruise controls, as well as your controls for your left screen, where you can access your RPMs, RPMs and oil temperature, your gauges, oil life, distance to empty, digital speedometer, um, and then you can also go into your trip and fuel, towing information, off-road status, and settings for your screen and some other features around your vehicle. Um, but then moving on to your center, your infotainment screen, which is radio, Sirius, CD, and Bluetooth capable, so you have some options there. You have your digital climate controls with dual zone front climate, Bluetooth phone controls, navigation so you hopefully won't get lost, whatever apps you may have installed, settings for your screen, and some other features around your vehicle, and uh, shifting into reverse, you have a backup camera so you can see where you're going. Moving down, you have your hazards and your physical media controls, as well as your physical climate controls, again with dual zone front climate, but also heated and air conditioned front seats. To the left, you have your 4x4 controls with 4 auto, trailer brake controller, uh, traction control shutoff, hill descent assist, and hatch release. And on the right, you have a 12 volt with a little cubby above it. And then down below, you have this little bin and then your main shifter with select shift on the side so you can manually shift through your gears and your tow haul mode button there as well. Then you have two cup holders and your center compartment slash armrest, which does have this little removable tray. And then two USBs and a 12 volt power outlet. And last but not least, you do have a power moonroof up top so you can land the sunshine. But that should cover our look at the interior. So now if you're interested, come visit us at Prince George Ford, pgford.ca, or call 250-563-8111 and have a nice day.